Thank you for joining us for Nakani's traditional medicine program winter story time series featuring indigenous authored and published children's books. Tonight I will be sharing with you Let's Go, a harvest story authored by Hannah Lindoff, illustrated by Clinkett artist Michaela Goad, and published by Sea Alaska Heritage Institute, Baby Raven Reads program. Let's Go, a harvest story. Go and get a bucket and come along with me. Let's hike into the woods to find a cedar tree. We'll fill our pail with long bark strips. If there's time, let's pick spruce tips. Spring is here, the ground is soft. Watch for puddles as you walk. Auntie's going to soak the bark and weave a hat when the nights grow dark. You see the beautiful night sky as she's sitting at the table with her auntie learning how to weave a cedar hat. Go and find a bucket. We'll take it down the path. The Yana 8 is growing fast. By the shore, we'll find a patch. We'll fill the bucket with the stalks and peel a few. As we walk, Yana 8 is my favorite snack with gumboots jarred in seal fat. Jump and get the buckets, the small ones you can carry. The gentle rains and longer days have ripened up the berries. Let's climb the hill behind our house and fill our buckets and our mouths. Orange, red, yellow, they're all sweet for ravens, bears, and kids to eat. See all the beautiful berries. She's soaking up the sun and filling her heart with good medicine of harvesting from our elders and loved ones. Look inside the bucket. There's something tasty there. Look at all the fresh caught crab. We've got enough to share. For sweet white meat in bright orange shells, our crab pots drift below the swells. A bright red buoy marks our pot. It's fun to see what we've caught. But more fun still is when we eat. We sit and laugh and pick the meat. Run and pack a bucket. Pack your long rain coat. Pack a snack, pack some ice, we're going on the boat. When Grandpa Sane makes a set, just see the salmon fill the net. Smoke it, bake it, pickle it dry. It's always great to eat sockeye. See all the beautiful bright salmon she's hanging to dry. Mmm, salmon is so yummy. Love that sockeye. Grab a little bucket and come walk with me. We're going to the meadow to pick some wild tea. The cold has turned some leaves brown, but look for green plants on the ground. They smell like summer's musty ripeness, the long lush days now behind us. We'll boil a pot on grandma's stove, the best thing for a runny nose. Beautiful silence in the woods, sitting with her dad, waiting for hunting for a buck. Go and snag a bucket. We need one more seat. Daddy got a great big buck, and now he cooks the meat. Put a pillow on the pail to fit one more around the table. Call the hunter, say, Ha -ga. to brother, auntie, and uncle, too. 
I'm looking for a bucket. Can you find one in the dark? Winter tides draw back the waves, and now the beach lies stark. Here where ocean has changed to land, fill a bucket with cockles and clams. We need a rake, we need warm clothes, we need a light. Now off we go. They're trekking through the darkness to go get their cockles and clams. What a fun nighttime adventure. Following their flashlight. Look what's in the bucket. Herring eggs on branches. Tiny eggs like yellow beads. On moccasins we dance in. Heron spawning in the sound means springtime isn't far from now. Crunch, crunch, pop, pop. Let's sit and eat while the elders talk. Come and see the cedar hat. Auntie's just now done. The land is filled with dewy leaves stretching toward the sun. Oh, go and get a bucket and come along with me. Let's hike into the woods to find a cedar tree. The end. Thank you for letting me share this story with you. I hope you enjoyed it. Please follow Nakani Native Program on Facebook and check out our YouTube channel to view the other stories that the Traditional Medicine Program is sharing throughout our winter storytime series. We want to thank you too, Sea Alaska Heritage, for allowing us the opportunity to share these stories with you. To purchase the book that was highlighted in tonight's video, please visit Sea Alaska Heritage Institute's Baby Raven Reads program at the link shown at the end of the video.